Here's how to download Axiom for Minecraft 1.21.6 and let's go. Now the first thing we need to do is install Fabric. This is the mod loader that is going to allow us to play with Axiom. Click on the second link in the description. This is a quick article in here on how to install Fabric in case this video is too fast for you. But if you want to make it a straight to the point, go down to step one and press on Fabric. That is going to redirect you over here where we're going to click Download Universal Jar and the download for the installer of Fabric will begin right away. And I want you to go ahead and place this file in your desktop. You can find it here on your recent download history or within the downloads folder of your computer. Now, once you got that file in your desktop, let's go ahead and download the Fabric API. If you have played using Fabric or Axiom before, you know that you need Fabric API for Axiom to work. So click on the third link in the description. That link is going to bring you right here. Select game version and select 1.21.6 and then just go ahead and hit download for the Fabric API. And just like we did earlier with the Fabric installer, we're going to go ahead and place the Fabric API in our desktop. OK, again, you can find that file here in your recent download history or within the downloads folder of your computer. Now, once you got the Fabric API as well as the Fabric installer in your desktop, it's time to download Axiom. Click on the fourth link in the description, select 1.21.6 and the game versions and then just go ahead and hit download right here. I'll begin the download of Axiom right away. And just like we have done with every other file so far, we're going to place Axiom in our desktop. And now we are ready to begin with the installation process. Now, the first thing you want to do is make sure you have closed your Minecraft launcher as well as your Minecraft game, but not before you have played Minecraft 1.21.6 vanilla at least once on your computer to create an instance for Fabric to install to. Now, once you played and close Minecraft as well as the Minecraft launcher, go ahead and double click on the Fabric installer. It's going to look just like this. Select Minecraft 1.21.6 and then hit install. And if for whatever reason, and you didn't get the fabric installer to open, just go ahead and install Java 21. That should fix the issue for you. Installing Java 21 is super quick and it is a requirement for any Minecraft about Minecraft 1.20.5 when installing mods. So once you install fabric, you're going to get this prompt in here. Click OK, close the installer and you could delete fabric from your desktop because you won't be using that anymore. Now we have Axiom as well as a fabric API and it's time to add those into the game. Open your Minecraft launcher. And of course, while we wait for Minecraft to open, shout out to Apex Hosting because they are giving you guys 35% off to the first 50 viewers who use the first link in the description to create a Minecraft server. They support over 200 mod packs. They have locations all around the world and they were kind enough to give you guys 35% off if you use the first link in the description to create your server with Apex Hosting. Now back with the tutorial, we see that the Minecraft launcher open and that we have Fabric Loader 1.21.6 selected automatically. That's because we installed it properly. But if we head over to installations, we should also see it in here. Of course, make sure you have modded selected. And as a matter of fact, you need to head over to installations to add Axiom as well as the Fabric API. So once you're over here, you're going to hover over Fabric and then you're going to press where it says open installations folder. That is going to open a folder that contains a lot of files. This is your Minecraft installation folder. But in here, we're just looking for another folder called mods. And as you can see, my mods folder is right here. But if you don't have a mods folder and I'm deleting mine so you can see what to do. If you don't have a mods folder, all you have to do is right click and press new and then press folder and then just name this new folder mods, M-O-D-S, just like that. Rename this folder into mods. Go ahead and open it. And all you have to do now, guys, is add the Fabric API as well as the Axiom mod into this folder. Just go ahead and drag and drop them into here. Make sure that if you're going to add any other mod into here, make sure they're compatible with Axiom as well as Fabric 1.21.6. And then once you're done, close this folder, head back into the Minecraft launcher and launch Fabric. Now, if you get a prompt in here, read through it. And if you agree, hit play one more time and then just wait for Minecraft to open. Now, once your game opens, just go ahead and launch a single player world to start using Axiom. Again, if you want to use this on your multiplayer server, you're going to have to use that first link in the description to create your server with Apex Hosting. And as you can see, I was already using Axiom in this world. But if that's not the case for you, whenever you launch a world, you're probably going to look more like this and you're going to be on the floor, right? You're going to be a player, a normal player. Well, now to open the Axiom editor, all you have to do is press right shift on your keyboard and it will open the editor just like that. And that is it, guys. That is how to get Axiom in Minecraft 1.21.6. If this video helped you out, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.